was good. It was uh, good to answer back on Saturday. Uh, I didn't think we had uh, the energy we needed on Friday night, but uh, I'm gonna bounce back and get two out of three on the road is pretty good. So tell me what it's been like for you with this road back from this injury, and how nice is it to be back on the ice with your teammates? Oh, it means the world. I mean, uh, I love the game, and it's uh, hard to be uh, in the stands at any point. So the um, guy's been awesome, and the coaching staff's been great, training staff. Uh, you know, it's, uh, it's been a, a long journey, but uh, definitely thankful to be back. We ended up playing in Rapids six games in a row. So it was a miniature uh, playoff series, uh, so to speak. We went 4-1-1 one, and one, uh, over those six games. So, you know, when you play a team that many times, uh, I think those are pretty uh, pretty good results, uh, getting the, the four wins and then the one overtime loss. So uh, something we can build off. Uh, we're playing good hockey at the moment. I like the way we're competing. Uh, I like the way we're on top of pucks. Uh, so I think that's a big part of our identity is, you know, we need to get in, we need to be aggressive, and then we need to reload above the puck. Uh, and be smart in our transition game. So uh, a lot of good things to build off, and uh, obviously we have a very good Jacksonville team coming in here this week. We've got to play with pace. Um, you know, we're finding um, when we're playing a connected hockey game, we're coming back with speed, uh, we're working below, uh, and then transitioning. Uh, you know, our pace can separate us, but we have to make sure we do it together. Uh, when we're five on the same uh, same page and going the same direction, uh, we can be pretty dangerous. So uh, it's something we have to continue to strive for. Yeah, Mitch Moraz and Ryan Farragher. Um, it's great having those guys. They both bring veteran leadership. Uh, you know, Mitch got his first two games in there uh, after being off for almost a year, and I thought he did great. So, um, you know, he was playing about 12, 13 minutes, and um, after that uh, amount of time off, uh, it was pretty impressive to see he didn't really miss a beat. So, uh, we're excited. We're, uh, we're going to keep uh, integrating him back in, and um, to have him in the room and on the ice and on the bench and contributing, um, you know, it's a big energy boost for us. Uh, then in terms of Ryan Farragher coming back from Stockton, you know, he's a veteran guy, he's a pro, um, you know, he knows how to win games in this hockey league, he knows how to carry himself day to day. Uh, we're really excited to have him back in the locker room and back on the ice and uh, they're both very welcomed additions.